you're dizzy, just drink more water. We hear that from the doctors all the time. It It's good advice on the front end of it because you rule out dehydration, which is a common problem with older people. Uh, but it's, it's just an initial question, and it's usually the only thing that people come away with. Strength is usually blamed. Um, core weakness is often blamed. This just comes with age, of course, is the most common. So when we look at the research, these are the factors that are most associated with falling. And this is according to diff six different large studies where they look at a bunch of different high quality studies. So meta-analyses where they put a lot of great research together. And basically these are the most associated factors. You notice age is not one of these factors listed. So exercising, history of falls, medications, use of assistive devices, whether they use them or not. Again, these are associated factors or not cause, but if you use a cane or a walker, there's an increased association with falling. Okay. Uh, how good the person's balance is, whether they have dizziness or vertigo, uh, fear of falling is huge. We'll talk about that. Uh, if their walking has changed or if they have problems with their walking, what's their home environment like, uh, whether they can dress and take care of themselves. Uh, and if they have cognitive challenges as well, Parkinson's is associated with falls as well. And frailty, we'll talk about frailty. This is very important. So of course, these are all preventable. So that's the good news. Age is not one of the factors associated on this list. 